Yeah. It's okay, it's okay. are making me afraid. What is going on? Vanessa, you have, you have to take it easy. Take what easy? God, God, God gives and God takes. Take what? Give what? What is going on? Vanessa. Paul, I see what happened this morning. No. He's your mom. My mom. No! 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 Wait! Wait! No! Wait! Mom! Uh, mom! <laughs> Rose! Yes, dear. You're distracting me. Can't you see I'm reading? So, what should I do about that? Don't you know exams are by the corner? Eh, eh, eh. Auntie, there's evening to read, though. Don't disturb my chatting, Biko. Man, you tell Mr. Dewali that when he starts failing us. That's your business. Oh my god. Oh my god. Thank you. I'm so sorry about what happened. Quick, come, come, sit. Rose, how are you? I'm so sorry. Thank you. Hey. How's everybody been? How have you guys been? Well, I've been okay apart from this one constituting a nuisance in the room. Excuse me, you are see. Mm. You guys are always fighting. Mm. That's cause of the nuisance you left me. Oh, please excuse me. Not now, not now, I beg. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. Ah, ah. Most you girls always argue. <laughs> ah, I missed you girls, Charles. I missed you too. I missed you. How did it go though? Well, just the... I miss him. So your father is dead, just like that. May his soul rest in perfect peace. Amen. Amen. You know what? Now that you're back, we have to do all it takes to leave no stone unturned as part of the preparations for our exams. My love, this is the perfect time to make sure our GP is very strong. If truly you want to leave this university. Rose, please. Thank you both. God bless the both of you. Because you guys have always been there for me, you know. I love you girls. You're my girls now. But don't worry. I know that we both of you. I know I'm going to do fine. We both of you, I know I'll pick up. She? You will. I trust you. Especially the Efiko. Who is the Efiko between me and her? Excuse me. Ah, you can't. Hey, hey. Hey, she's never ever approached Okay, okay, both of you. Both of you are Efiko. Both of you are Efiko. All of us are Efiko. Okay, so when you get there, just turn.
All right, thank you. Yes, thank you. Well, God bless you. Considered for the job on probation. Please, sir. Oh, thank you, sir. Thank you so much, sir. You're welcome. Yes, You're welcome. Sir. Please see the receptionist. She will furnish you with the necessary information because oh. you'll be going to our Lagos branch. Lagos branch? Yes. Ah, thank you, sir. It's okay, sir. You're welcome. Thank you. You're welcome. You can have your file. Please. Oh, thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. All right. Yes, sir. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Um, are you new around here? Because I don't think I've seen your face before. Uh, yes, you're actually right. I just moved into Lagos and I'm just coming to the estate. I okay. was actually given this address. Oh, wait, I don't I, know if you know this place. Take a look at it. Uh, uh, the okay. first one is the address where I'm going to. The second one is the company address where I'm supposed to work tomorrow. All right, that's no, uh, no problem. I'll take you to the address here right now. Okay. And then I'll come pick you up in the morning. Oh, you know, really? take it to work, yeah. So, you, you know the address where I'm going to? Of course I do. Let me I, help you with your luggage. Oh, thank, oh, thank you. And you know the company where I'm going to work? I do, tomorrow? I do. By the way, my name is Stan. Stan Lee. Okay, um, the, the, the Vanessa. Vanessa. Uh, yeah. <laughs> it's alright, darling. You're such a gentleman, thank you. <laughs> okay. It's actually my first time in Lagos. Really? Yeah. Okay. All right. So please oh, um oh. hop in. Thank you. You're Thank welcome. You. Oh. Thank you. So So you live in the estate? Yeah, I do. Oh, okay. Wow. Um Lagos, you're coming from where actually? Yes, I'm actually coming from Oh, yeah. yeah, please, can you hold this for me? I'm coming. One minute. Uh, what's this? See, if you can't hold it, just put it on the table. Ah. Oh. oh, yeah, let's go. The boss has said that he wants you to do this. Yes, okay. uh, some, yes. some small, small mistakes. Okay? 
Good morning. Hi. Vanessa, right? Yes. Welcome. Thank you. My name is Raymond Njoko and that's Kemi Ajose. Uh, okay. Nice to meet you here, darling. Yeah. Oh, so this will be your place in the office. Okay. This is Thank your corner. You. Thank you. Okay. Um, there is something the director wants you to take a look at, right? So I'll get it from my table. All right. Okay. So, uh, the director wants you to look at this, yeah? Okay. Uh, very quickly, and then make your input. All right, okay. okay? Thank All you, right. I'll do that now. Thank you so much. Uh, Yes, yes. <laughs> Thank you. I'm good. You okay? Sure. Need any help? No. Sure. No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so. Hi. Hi. Hey, forgive my manners. My name is uh, Benedict. My colleagues call me Ben. My name is Benice Joel. Vanessa. Miss Vanessa, I guess. <laughs> well, if you just care to know, yes. <coughs> Miss Vanessa? Yeah. Remember? Director? Your thoughts? Oh, yeah. Oh. No, no, wait. You, you, you just still have to just, um, I think you need to sign I this. just did that. I you just did, did that, yeah. Thank right. you. Um, where is this office? Uh, out the door, first left. Oh, thank yeah. you. Um, excuse me. Yes. Door on the left. So come, let me just, I need to show you. She knows her lips. I'm so sure she knows her lips. <laughs> well, you know you're right. Right. You're right. I told you like your hair. You too easy for you, Susia. I'm sorry, sir. I, I, I'm very sorry, sir. I, 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 didn't, I didn't mean to be rude to you this, this morning. I, I, I didn't mean to take your gentle man nature for granted. I am so sorry. No, okay. Just drop the document on the table. I will call you if need be, all right? Good. I'm, I'm so sorry, sir. It's all right. So sorry. Can I drop you off um, after work at home? Yes, sir. Uh, so, sorry, sir. So you know, sir? Yes, it is. 5.30 to be ready, I'll drop you off at home. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir.
What are you hiding? Everyone in this office knows we are dating. I love you. Tell me you love me too. I'm waiting. I love you. Say yours. Love you. Yeah, of course we are in love, and I love you so much. Abuja, Kadunia, and Abekuta, they've called us back to tell us that they have received the consignment. But we're yet to get a call from... I'm going to be busy. Um, so, like I was saying to... Doing what? Vanessa? <laughs> Me bad. Um, what I was trying to say, sir, is like I'm going to be at home resting and doing a lot of work, like a lot of house chores. So... Okay. Well, um, you see, there's this um, movie showing at the cinema. Very interesting from what I heard. But the thing is this, I cannot go and see it alone. Can we go together? Please. Um, um, sir, so I would have loved to go watch that movie with you. You know, but like I said, I've got so many things to do at home. I love workload and, um, I probably would, I will do that next time. We'll go watch it together next time, no problem, sir. So sorry I said no. Um. Okay, it's all right. Okay. You can go, I'll call you later, but uh, perhaps you may have a change of heart. Okay, um, like I was saying earlier, sir, Imo, we haven't gotten a it's call. Okay, sweetheart. I have the report already. Oh, I see. Really? All right. Now I know you, you have this premonition about you trying to know my relationship with Kemi, but I, I, I'm just go, I'll just cut it to the chase. Um, well, yes, fact. Kemi and I have this relationship. Mm. And then, fact. Kemi is married. And then, and then fact. Kemi's husband doesn't stay here, he stays abroad. But that still can hold us back in, in, in all that. Because Vanessa, if, if only you can tell me that like, you, you really do care about me, then I am just ready to jump. Just, just, just tell me to jump and I'll ask you how high. Say, how jump. Old no, no, I'm, I'm just trying to let you know how much I really do care about you. And how much I really do want us to, to really, to really be together. That's just what I'm just saying. <laughs> you know, I'm not just. Look, I, I, hold on. I understand. You wait. You can investigate about us. I'm ready. I'm ready to just cough out anything beyond what I've just spoken. Ben, I've heard everything you've talked about, your love life with Kemi and all that. And I understand. 
I understand she's married, so you can't, you know, like, take the relationship a step further. I understand yeah. everything you're trying to say. Yeah. Yeah. But honestly, I need you to give me time. Time to search my inner mind. And time to do my investigation. Because I need to find out for sure that if at the end of the day, I have to say yes, I need to be sure of what I'm saying yes to. D don't, don't get me wrong. You're very cute. Okay. Say you're they, handsome. Oh, I'm handsome. And you're sexy. You're every lady's I'm man. I'm sexy. <laughs> ah, come on, stop flashing yourself. No. You know, but that's the fact. I like you. I like you a whole lot. But I, no, no, Ben. I need to find out exactly what's going on and what I want. Listen to me. Listen to me. Just what? say I'm fine again. Just say I'm fine. <laughs> I'm not saying it. <laughs> no, listen. What? I don't have any problem giving you time, but what you just said just, just, just spurred me into my oblivion. It just opened the Pandora's box about me. <laughs> it's, it just sorted me. When back then in school and, and then back then in my alma mater, when, when everywhere I go to, I was a fine boy in school, I was a fine guy. Mm -hmm. I just command this, this presence, and everybody calls me Ben. Oh, Ben. And I, I just, just reply to them, and I say, yeah, the boy. The boy. I am the boy. The boy. The boy. So the, so the boy. The boy, what can be? The boy. The boy. Where did you get that Mac from? Is that a bed Mac? What? You have a, is it a cot or a bed Mac? Something on you? Oh no, it is just a, no, it's just a, <laughs> you know, teenagerhood, <laughs> zestful hood. I was such an exciting guy in school, so a lot of things happened to me, but God has just saved me. I know. <laughs> and, uh, my cash and my presence, my, my, my panache. Just oh so my God, you're, so, <laughs> you're such a funny guy. There's just so much. So you, you had fun in school. Fun in school, mm -hmm. it's fine. Just, you know. Yeah. No problem. So. We're just, it's how to yeah. uh, achieve. Achievements in the meeting Vanessa and then <laughs> having this beautiful Oh, uh, I haven't said this yet. They're not going to touch that. Chico. I don't get it. Why, why did you say that? Boy, director I did there. And you know the man. He will throw thunder and brimstone if you follow and struggle for that day. 
and it's, it's not possible now. It's not possible. I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't, look, I can't, I can't leave her. You get? I can't leave Vanessa, man. Who will be able to secure your future now? What are you talking about, securing my future? There's no future for me without Vanessa. Do you get? Can't you, can't you feel my passion? Can't you feel? What do you talk just now? So you really feel my passion. There's no future without Vanessa now. <laughs> God. Oh, God, I'm sick. <laughs> Guys, you need to laugh now. You know why they laugh? Why now? I want to help you update your CV because that man will sack you tomorrow. <laughs> There's no future. Guy, tell me now. Tell me. Talk to me now. Tell There's me. There's no you... future without Vanessa. There's no future. Then we die without Vanessa. Guy, talk to me now. There's no future. Then we die without Vanessa. Stella. It's not that I don't like you. It's not that I don't find you attractive. It's not that I don't appreciate you. I do. But you don't trust me. How am I supposed to trust you when I see you frolicking with my staff, Ben? How am I supposed to trust you? Come on, think about it. Stanley, I, I told you. I already came out clean to you. I told you, I said Ben and asked me out first, before you. I, uh, how was I supposed to think that you would ask me out? I'm one of your staff. I never thought you would ask me out. And Ben did. How would you feel? How would you feel if you were the first person to ask me out? And I said yes to you. And the next minute I say no. How would you feel? I can't do that to Ben. I am sorry. Stanley. I can't. I can't date you. I am sorry. I am sorry. I am deeply sorry. somebody who's gonna have a heart of gold just like you. I'm sorry. I... I can't date you. I cannot say no to Ben. I need you to understand. Please. Please. Vanessa. Listen to me. Don't you think you should think this through? Like, think about, think about this thing again. I beg you. Please. I have told the truth. I have. I'm sorry. I just observed it. Do you understand? I mean, we're just the topic of discussion in, in the whole office and I mean, come on. Is it wrong for us to actually express our feelings to each other, even in public? I don't know. I is don't it? Know. I'm, also, I'm also surprised. I don't know what's going on. I mean, it's more ambiguous and inexplainable to me. I don't understand the tussle between the director and you. Oh. I mean, he's so hell-bent on having me to himself. He just cannot wait to take me away Listen, from you. Listen, I swear to you, if he pushes it so far, I'd rather resign than allow that bastard, that fool, take you away from me. I'm serious. Really? Uh, you resign for me? Babes, I will resign. Nobody can take you away from me. I swear to you, nobody. They can't even try it. I can't allow you just fizzle out of my life like that. It's not possible. I won't let that happen. I can do anything. I can do anything. Okay. Prove it. Do 
need to prove it. I know, 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 that you and I are meant to be, that you and I are meant to live forever together. You told me to prove it to you, right? Yes. I want you to know that you're the best thing that's ever happened to me. You're just that beautiful woman in my life that I cannot let go. And from today, I hereby make an oath from this radiator water, from this car, that if I ever let you go, that if I ever marry a woman after you or before you, me everything bad happens to me in this car. Oh, come on, don't say that. Really? It's gonna drop. It's gonna drop. <laughs> <laughs> but you so, know what, darling? Yeah. I can't marry you. I can't. Say that. Why? I can't because you're every lady's man. Oh. Oh, and I'm so a jealous bad. type, you know? So I need a man that I can call my own. My own man. I don't want to share you with anybody. <laughs> and I know you've got a lot of women running after <laughs> wait, you. Wait, 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 wait. Come here. Forget about that. Yeah, they'll come. They'll go. But nobody can beat you. Give me a kiss. Give me a kiss. <laughs> Not no. But give me a kiss no. no. Nobody can beat you. Come. Come here. Nobody, I, I promise you, I swear to you. I swear to you by God. And I swear to you that I would never leave you. And nobody's gonna ever come between us. And we're gonna be together till death do us part. I love you. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm. So touch. Sir, I'm so sorry to bother you this afternoon. But I need to call your attention to one little thing that I noticed though. Because with the way our company has been going all this while, you can see that it's been moving smoothly. See you, this girl called Vanessa arrived. And of course now, you see how everything has been moving now. It's not been moving the way we've been going before. Everything is now turning upside down, slow things, business is not going well. I'm so sorry, Sal, but she is the major problem, sir. Not Ben, no. Not Ben. That Vanessa is the problem. She's just making everybody go crazy in this office. Reasons I don't know. And the rumor even has it that even you have your eyes on her too. Well, I don't know how true that is, sir. But whatever it is, the only solution to this big problem is eradication, sir. Yes, sir. Let's find a way to eradicate Vanessa. As soon as Vanessa leaves this company, we will get our proper balance, sir. Please. Please, sir. That is just the only solution. Let us eradicate her. Are you done? Yes, yes, sir. It's very important, sir. Leave my office and shut the door properly. I should call her, sir, because we really need... Get out of my office. Okay, sir. Ben, are you sure you're making a very good decision here? How can you ditch a lucrative career and a promising future because of your infatuation? Well, I don't know what you call it, but I don't agree to what you just said. It's uh, my own decision, it's my own uh, choice, so I'm fine with it. I owe nobody any explanation, so it's fine. Besides, I have to do it now. If I don't do it, you're probably going to do it someday, isn't it? So. Fine. Good. <laughs> You're making a very big mistake, man. No, sir. Rather, I'm making a very good mistake. 
Thank you. I wish you the best of luck. Ah, Kemi, what's up now? Oh my god, this is a pleasant surprise. <laughs> Welcome to my house. How you doing? Sit down. Do you want us to drink? Is that a problem? You good? Yeah. How was work? Work, work was fantastic today. Okay. How are you doing? I'm good. Oh I just prepared your favorite, so you need to go refreshing up, you know. By the time you're done, your food will be ready. Really? Mm -hmm. So you put those? <laughs> yes, those bocatoes that you like. <laughs> yeah, that's what so I'm... So how's your day? It was beautiful. I was able to, you know, con conquer a lot, and then at, at some point, Excuse me, let me just, let me speak to this man. Okay. Yeah, hi, Mr. Pedro. <laughs> yes, good. Um, thank you so much for your efforts, and uh, I, I, I'm most obliged. I appreciate your... Yes, I mean, finally, we've got it. It is beautiful. Thank you so much. All right, so, 
uh, my manager will get those documents for you ready by, by 10 a.m. tomorrow. It's going to be on your table, yeah? Thank you so much. I'm most obliged, yeah? You're far too kind. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, I see you. 10 a.m. Yeah, 10 a.m. Right. So you got a new contract? Yeah. <laughs> oh, let me tell you something. All thanks to you, darling. Ever since you came into my life, it's just goodness just comes into my way. Favors, opportunities, contracts, cars, houses, you know, money, things just get coming. I, I just so love you so much. I love you so much, darling. I love you. What you do? I love you. you sure? Yes, I do. Say that again, say that again. I love you. <laughs> um, mm, mm. Oh, okay, you yeah. know what? You need to go refreshing yourself up, you know? Go, go, no, go. I, I thought I was just... And no, why? don't start that. I know what you're trying to do. No. All right, let me just go. But when I come down, something is going to happen, yeah? <laughs> Ooh, yeah, yeah. yeah. I know, 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 I know. And you and I. What's going on? Why are you standing here all alone? What's going on? Why are you here all alone? Well, baby, I was just. It's a lie, though. It's a lie. At the end of the day, the devil cannot, not take my mind not deceive me because I've just been here pondering that uh, like it's a fault of mine or your fault like we don't have kids and all that it's it's we have to wait on guard because yes it's two years of marriage and all that and uh, there there's still no issue and but I can allow the devil to get into my head it's not gonna happen. So I believe you. You're gonna give me good, good children. I believe so much in you. Come here. <laughs> Thank you, darling. Yeah. So I'm not worried. You're right. You're right. It's just two years, but it's also a long time. It's two years gone, and I mean, no cry of a baby in the house. I understand that you don't want me to be worried, but at the same time, obviously I'm gonna be worried. I understand that fact, and that's a nice one. I appreciate that, and I love you for it. But you know what, honey? We have to worry, because you know, we would love to hear the cry of a baby in this house. And the fact that it's not happening calls for us to worry. And, and you know what, darling? The worst thing that can happen to any man is to lie to himself. It's the most destructive thing that can happen to a man. And it is a lie. It's a lie. It's a lie that we cannot worry. It's a lie that I shouldn't worry. It's a lie that you shouldn't worry. It's a lie. I love your wisdom. I love your your innate brilliance. All right. I I I if I can't I can't say I'm worried, but why don't we see a doctor and then he could decipher what is wrong? It could be from me, it could be from you, it could be from even the food we eat, you know how these things are, you know, in general. That's just the best thing to do, baby. That's the best thing to do. Yeah. So we're gonna see a doctor tomorrow. Maybe not so but we're just Oh, there. come <laughs> on. Let's see a doctor. You never can tell. And uh, I'm upset with you. Why? Because you got yourself a drink and you didn't get me one. I was thinking, no. Let's... No. You've been a naughty boy and I'm going to teach yeah, yeah, you a lesson. What? I want to do right now. What? Oh, oh it's good. <laughs> <laughs> no, nothing. Because you got yourself no, a drink without getting... No. No. Um, Mr. and Mrs. Williams. Yes. What I'm about to ask for might sound a little bit um, surprising. Right. 
But as a doctor, I have the right to do so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, mm -hmm. you can tell us. Of course, <laughs> it's you okay. Do. It's okay. Yeah. Please, sir, can you just excuse me and your wife? I, I want to talk to her one on one. Mm -hmm. Okay, you, you can, you can talk to her. It's okay if it's. Oh no, honey, come on. No. You're going nowhere, darling. No, but he said he wasn't. No. Doctor, he's my husband, and I love him. And two has become one, so there's no more, there's no secret between us. Whatever you have to say, you can say it in his presence. It's fine. Yeah, it's okay. Yeah. Uh, madam, it seems you don't really understand. You know, sometimes there are some things that are. Doctor is fine. You can say whatever you have to say in the presence of my husband. Yeah. We sure. love each other so much. <laughs> we yeah. do. All we right. can take anything, right? Sure. It's the doctor's <laughs> <laughs> conversation. It's I okay. Know. Yeah. All right. Um, madam. Mm hmm. Have you Papa, no ves. Papa, no ves. Es más correcto que usted no ves. No ves, no ves, papá. Ah. Papá, you know it's in my room. Ah. You be crazy. You know it's in my room.
Stop! Stop! Ah! Ah! Boss! Yeah! Have a nice day! Boss! Brother! Bye 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 bye! Bye bye! Bye no bye! Who put on the pass? The boy, the boy is just... To help you. Come out, though. Ah. I don't tell you. I don't tell you before. You see now. Come out, Baba, Baba, Baba. Do quick, do quick, do quick, go. Ah. Come on, wait a bit. The point, the point. I beg. The combo people on the pass. Ah. Yes. Ben, no Ben. Ah. Shut up, just do. I don't die. I don't die. Baba. Ah, Baba. Now wait a bit, please. Now wait till you do. This one a blood hole. Where? For where now? She. Now wait till you do. Now wait till you do. Call. I do come. Yes. You call. You do come. I do come. Okay. Clear up. Okay, okay, okay. You clear up. Now he rape him. Now she rape him. No, no, no. You won't be back. Hey, see him for you now. I'm sorry, oh. Now wait till you go do the grace. Now I don't be this. Now wait till you go do. I didn't know I had to travel. That guy there inside, oh. Hey. Vanessa, mm. you're scaring me. Okay, take water, please. Mm -mm. Hey, Jesus. What, okay, what do you want? Please now, please take something. Where is it? Is it here? Hey! Hi, guys. You're shouting like this. You don't want to know who I saw please, today. Please now, please. Is everything okay? You're scaring me, seriously. Rose. <sighs> Vanessa. Why is nobody answering me? Sorry, sorry. Please, please, no. Wait a minute. Don't tell me this is what I'm thinking. Rose, did you give her the concussion this morning? Hey, what happened? I do not know its result to this But now. I told you not to. Why don't you ever listen? Why don't you? I thought I advised you against it. Look at what you put her through now. Why? But oh, Vanessa, why did you even have to listen to this girl in the first place? Why? You, I, I, I mean, I, I know you got raped and then you got pregnant. But you won't be the first person this will happen to. You could have just gone to the hospital. Okay, fine. You're just shouting, shouting. What can be done to this situation? And it has already been Why are you happened. asking me? You should have thought twice. So what should we do now? You know, if anything happens to Vanessa, I will personally report it to the school authority. Please, no. Ah! Vanessa, let's take her to the next day. Please, please, please. please. Oh, 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 She was so wicked! And you abused me on all levels. Yes, sir. You broke me. You destroyed me. You killed me! But I tried. I tried. I tried to pick up the pieces of my life and move on. Because I was young and I wanted the best for myself. But the unfortunate happened. The unfortunate happened. I got pregnant! I was dying! A bastard in my womb! Your child! I was pregnant. And this was a period when I was writing my exams. For my first year semester, my, my last exams, my promotional exams. How could I be pregnant? How could I carry a bastard inside of me? I was lost. Because it was not one thing. Because I hated it. I hated myself and I hated you. And yes, I listened to my friends. I, I, I took some concussion and I lost my womb. I did not 
I'll just lose you, baby. I didn't know just about that chap. I, I lost my womb. I destroyed my future! All because of you! All because of you. And I had no one. No one to go to. Because the only person in my life, the only person I loved, the only person I could relate to, my mom. She died on me. And my whole life, my whole world kept crashing down right before my eyes. But yes, I, yes, I, I needed to move on. So I did. I did. But all this is because of you. Because of your ruthlessness, your carelessness, your heartlessness. Stop it. Stop it. Just, just listen to me. Listen to me. Listen to me. Please. Please, Vanessa. You know, I was, I was young. I was naive. I was, I was so stupid. I was a kid. Back then in school, I was carried away with, with everything. Spare me all that! Forgive me, just forgive me. Find it in your heart to just forgive me. I was all taken away. Please. Please. If you don't want to forgive me, what else did you want me to do? What did you want me to do if you don't? You want me to, me to cut off my genitals? You want me to cut off my life? You want me to cut off my soul and give it to you? Oh my God. You don't get it. You don't. My love, I have forgiven you a long time ago. I have forgiven you. <laughs> because you know what? It's all on you. You have paved the way for your childlessness. <laughs> yes, so we're in it together. We're gonna dance to it together. Stop. All the wrong you did many years ago, it is time for you to dance to that freedom. Just stop it. Just stop it. Stop it. I stop. never loved you. I never did. I was in love with Stalin. He was caring. He was loving. He was everything. But I couldn't. I couldn't allow him pay for your wrongs. I couldn't allow him marry a barren woman like myself. He did not deserve that. He did not deserve me. So it is your quest. It is your pain. It is your wrong. And that you alone are going to dance to that freedom. Do you understand me? So, it's fine. Let's celebrate. We are both childless. So we have to celebrate. I'm done. Oh, come on. I need a drink. Can you get me one?
So, um, you told your mother everything? Yes, yes, I did. And surprisingly, she was happy and ready to meet you. <laughs> Are you serious? You told her you're pregnant for me? Of course, yes. You know she's my mom, so I can confide in her. <laughs> uh, so good. So good to really hear that. Oh. I'm, I'm really impressed, you know. Yeah. And guess what? What? Your visa just came out. So, America, here we come. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> I know! Oh, yeah. I just can't wait! Really? <laughs> Someone will be in the US soon! <laughs> it came out and then... Um, but I just want us to prepare all the traditional rites okay. and do everything so that, you know, um, we'll just find it easier to, I you know, have fun. I know. I can't wait, <laughs> Same here, same here. So, oh. well, how's my child? How's my child doing? My son? Oh. Fine? Sure, he's fine. You sure? So fine. He just can't <laughs> wait to meet daddy. I know. I can't wait <laughs> my, my, to, miss, to meet him too. All right, great. Have you eaten? No, I haven't. You should eat. Because there's no way you're going to keep my baby hungry. Please. <laughs> you should just Please. eat, yeah? That's so beautiful. Oh, come here, you. come here. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Um, madam, uh, we tried all we could to make your husband walk back on his feet. The result from the expert says, if that is going to happen, then it will be a miracle from God. So we just have to accept it. He can walk again. <laughs> uh, madam. Are you with me, madam? Yeah. Oh, uh, don't do that. Okay, okay, calm down, madam, please, please. We are going to be discharging him tomorrow. And uh, you need to see the nurse at the desk. Okay. Sorry about that. Honey, you haven't eaten your food. It's gonna get cold. Huh? Why now? What? What's going on? Are you okay? What's wrong with you, darling? What's the matter? Kill me. Kill me and end it. My love. Why would I want to kill you? You're my husband and I love you. So why would I wish you death? 
That's impossible. Hmm? Look into my eyes. And tell me you have no hands in those pred predicaments. Tell me you have no hand in the in this in this condition that I'm in right now. Tell me you have no hands in the accident that has kept me in this position right now. And say me, look at my eyes. Tell me your hands. It's not in this. Hi, darling. Hi, baby. Choo 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 choo. Choo 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 How you doing, darling? Honey, I think we need to get more of those babies in the house so we can have more kids to play with. <laughs> Hi, baby. Isn't she beautiful? <laughs> Um, unfortunately, darling, you are the etiquette of your own problem. <laughs> A man shall always sow what he reaps, no matter how he tries to run away from it. Mm. So you were planning to dump me. You were planning to run away with that little thing. That girl. Mm. It's never gonna happen. Because I have a God. And he sees everything. He knows everything. So how would he allow such to happen to me and my baby? Mm? You thought you could go away from me. It's not possible, my love. It can never happen. Because you and I are meant to be together forever. We are gonna be together for life. I need to remind you of that hold you took. Oh. Yeah, I'm telling you, I, I just I just observed it. Do you understand? I mean, we're just the topic of discussion in, in the whole office and I mean, come on, is it wrong for us to actually express our feelings to each other, even in public? I don't know. Is it? I'm also, I'm also surprised. I don't know what's going on. I mean, it's more ambiguous and inexplainable to me. I don't understand the tussle between the director and you. Oh. I mean, he's so hell-bent on having me to himself. He just cannot wait to take me away Listen, from you. Listen, I swear to you, if he pushes it so far, I'd rather resign than allow that bastard, that fool, take you away from me. I'm serious. Really? Uh, you resign for me? Babes, I will resign. Nobody can take you away from me. I swear to you, nobody. They can't even try it. I can't allow you just fizzle out of my life like that. It's not possible. I won't let that happen. I can do anything. I can do anything. Okay. You told me to prove it to you, right? Yes. I want you to know that you're the best thing that's ever happened to me. You're just that beautiful woman in my life that I cannot let go. And from today, I hereby make an oat from this radiator water, from this car, that if I ever let you go. But if I ever marry a woman after you or before you, then everything bad happens to me in this car. Oh, come on, don't say that. Really? It's gonna drop. It's gonna drop. Oh. <laughs> but you know so, what that means? Yeah. I can't marry. I can't. Why? I can't because you're 
every lady's man. And I'm a jealous type, you know. So I need a man that I can call my own. My own man. I don't want to share you with anybody. <laughs> and I know you've got a lot of women running after <laughs> wait, you. Wait, 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 wait. Come here. Forget about that. Yeah, they'll come. They'll go. But nobody can beat you. Give me a kiss. Give me a kiss. <laughs> Not no. But give me a kiss now. No. Nobody can beat you. Come. Come here. Nobody, I, I promise you, I swear to you. I swear to you by God. And I swear to you that I would never leave you. And nobody's going to ever come between us. And we're going to be together till death do us part. I love you. Mm. So, you think a mere oat, a mere radiator oat, can hold me down? Wait until this whole thing is over. Till then, you would know. No oat can hold me down. I swear to you. You wish. Until then. <laughs> and I wish, I wish it could be so, but unfortunately it is not going to be so. It is too late, my love. I love you. I'm in this together. Nobody's going nowhere. Well, it's unfortunate that any lost the pregnancy. And I really do feel sorry for her. You know what, darling? Anyone who tries to have a baby for you will also be so unfortunate. <laughs> Just like him. You don't have to cry, baby. Because you are the strong man that has made me a strong woman. You are a wicked man. That has made me a wicked woman. <laughs> and yes, you are also the reason why we are both childless. <laughs> and together, forever, we will be together. So death do us part. No one is going to take you away from me. No one. You go nowhere and I go nowhere. I love you. I love you, baby. It's okay. Oh, see, our baby's not happy, you know. Our baby's not happy that you're crying. <laughs> baby, come here, come here, come here. Come to daddy. Daddy, says daddy, don't cry. Goes around, comes around, goes around, comes around. A little bit of this, a little bit of that. Come to the dad, get a little world. Goes around, comes around, goes around, comes around. A little bit of this, a little bit of that. A little bit of this, a little bit of that. What goes around, comes around, what goes around, comes around. One, two, three, a numbers, A, B, C, a letters, success, failure, good or bad. There is no smoke without fire, there is no rest without sowing, whatever I sow, you reap. What goes around, comes around, be good, oh, be good, be good, oh, be good. What goes around, comes around, goes around. A little bit of that, coming to the dark, get a little what goes around, comes around, what goes around, comes around. A little bit of this, a little bit of that, a little bit of this, a little bit of that, what goes around, comes around, what goes around, comes around. A little bit of this, a little bit of that, coming to the dark, get a little what goes around, comes around, what goes around. Comes around a little 
little bit of this, a little bit of that, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. What goes around, comes around, what goes around, comes around. One, two, three, a number.